sadly, it's not good news. Antifa are back with their antics, uh, this time in Atlanta, where they're rioting after, well, a leftist activist was killed this week by police after he shot and wounded a state trooper. Let's have a look at some of the violence that we're seeing on the streets of Atlanta and also let's look at how the media has gone back to their lies about this being a mainly peaceful place. here if you pan over i want to show you this is what they are handing out at the protest so it was a largely peaceful protest where they just wanted what they're calling justice uh for to to uh, for to 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 get to to i so sorry the only act of, of violence against people that i saw were, were attacked on these protests i mean really this is just shameless stuff and it's uh Let's have a look at ABC News. They didn't want to miss out on the uh, on the fun. They posted this. They said six people were arrested after a peaceful protest over a proposed police training round. What's funny is that with that they posted a clip of a burning police car. So you know, in the one sentence they've got a peaceful protest, and then you've got to see mayhem. Be 